Looney Farm Guy here and in this video we'll be looking at the update to the large old barn by VX Mapping on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this demonstration and retest. So we're going to retest this entire thing because there's been a lot of changes to this mod. Uh, 3D modification, enlarged doors, addition of an external outlet for milk. As you can see here, I do believe that is the external outlet for milk. So we're going to test that. Trigger of displaced milk. I think that's still related to that. Addition of marker to indicate the openings of the nets and roof windows. So let's go in and look at that right now. So here's a little icon here. And let's get our help window on. There we go. And open the roof. And you can see there, the roof is opening. So that's uh, nice that you have now a little icon to show, hey, there's the trigger for that. What about the trigger for the netting? And I don't remember, I don't know if I ever found it on the last review, but here it is over here. Now it has a little icon say, hey, open the net. Okay. And there we go. See the nets, the sides are opening and we have one on this side as well. There we go. Very nice. So those are the um, changes. So there's more correction for loading points for AI. Um, not sure how to. I don't. I don't use AI to do that. Um, modification of the number of cows. Yes, number of cows. Two hundred and sixteen cows. The animal dialogue is here. Two hundred and sixteen. We have some dairy cows in there at the moment. Uh, changes in quantities, changed descriptions to raise and lower the nets and roof window. Yes, okay. And other minor fixes, right. So if you recall, there is an integrated manure collection point. Slurry is here. And uh, lights, lights, uh, shed lights, L3. There we go. And the other lights... I don't remember where the other light switch was for here. Uh, although I do, if I recall, perhaps they were automatic. Now I don't remember. However, that isn't included in the update. There is, there we go. Oh, that's, that's not those. I think they're automatic, if I remember. Uh, there's light switches everywhere. Light switches in here. Okay, so uh, quantities. Straw, 100,000. Total capacity of food, 180,000 liters. Straw and food both go in here, where you see this little icon in this. Uh, it's quite a large area here. You should not have a hard time putting food or straw in. It will take bales. Um, we have interior rooms here and here. Ah, uh, yes, I believe shed lights. Was that the, uh, yeah, lights, lights everywhere. Right, so what's going to happen now? We're going to go ahead a month and see how all these uh, things, uh, there's lights on the outside, all these things pan out then. All right, so what has transpired? Let's take a look. Food, yes, we're down about half-ish. And straw, we got plenty of straw. Let's show you the straw going in. I put them in by vehicle, but bales are also accepted, and that starts right there. There we go. See? Straw is already filled. All right. Yes. No. What? Oh, there we go. Straw disappeared once I threw it over there as well. So here or there, some there were thereabouts. Right. So food capacity, as we said, still looks good. Oh, let's run down to the end and see about our manure and then we'll test the milk and slurry oh my well we have manure that's that's good uh 42,000 liters of it slurry 54,000 liters uh to do, 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 do milk 26,000 okay let's hop in to our there we go let's uh test out the old milk um trigger here and see where it gets picked up and start filling. So yes, the milk trigger works just fine. Very nice. 
slurry and slurry trigger works as well and that's very nice as well let's see if we can get this tractor in there and oh well don't attempt to drive through there with a dual wheels on on any tractor however it probably would have fit in there if I had singles but the roof clearance uh, if you're going in there with a tipper uh, there is some room if you can get a tipper trailer in here not a lot so a small tipper or there's plenty of uh, bottom dump trailers side dump etc and so forth or end dump type trailers uh, let's see just for just for giggles we have a semi truck which is narrow enough and an end dump trailer let's just put uh let's uh let's see where is the tmr sorry this is a bit of an impromptu so tmr and let's see if we can drive this semi through this is an end dump trailer so as long as we can fit it in there it should be able to dump in and uh not that it takes an enormous amount of food however um some of you might have uh, trailers full of TMR that you might want to bring in here and we fit we fit and there we go so being an end dump trailer there we go we just end dumped it and we can fit in there with a semi so that's pretty nice that's uh, plenty enough room I believe for sure oh we got just caught caught just a tiny bit on there but we made it so uh neat all right i would say overall improved um i can't remember what the cow capacity was before it just said uh, changes in quantum modified the number of cows so i don't remember if it was more or less from last time However, there you go there. That's the update 2.000 to Large Old Barn by VX Mapping on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you all for watching. And remember, it's only a game. So till next time, bye for now.